One of the reasons why you don't want to go into real estate full time is because if you got nothing that's going to support you and help you pay the bills, it's going to be very uncomfortable for you <clears throat> in the beginning of real estate. Real estate is going to take more time than you think to produce some sort of consistent income. If you are going to be <clears throat> banking on this one client and hoping that this client is going to close, <clears throat> then um, you are going to show off some desperation. Desperate agent and unmotivated client is a recipe for disaster. You definitely don't want to have that kind of situation. And that's why it's super important to have something that's helping you pay the bills. I went in full time, but the only reason I went in full time, because there's two reasons why I went full time. One is because I had savings from the previous thing that I was doing. I was doing a little business and I had some savings and was able to go through them, actually I burned all of them and then even more through my credit card before I got going. And number two, I knew that if I was doing the two things simultaneously, and this real estate thing is not producing any income in the beginning, I would focus less and my growth would be much lower. And so those are two reasons, but I just knew it myself. I had to go all in, but if I had no savings, I would never go all in full time right away. So my advice is to go part-time first, 100%, figure things out, put in as much time as you can, sleep less, you know, figure it out, sleep less. Uh, and do the things that are most important. Do the content, do the calls, do the tags, do the DMs, do your social media, work on getting, getting to know more people and building more relationship as fast and as soon as you can and as much as you can in the beginning and have something to pay your bills. So your approach to clients is, is not please buy, please because I need to pay my bills. It's going to be, I understand, let's take time and sometimes even talk them out of doing the, 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 the buy or sell comfortably because your bills are taken care of. This thing is you're, you're building, you're playing the marathon. If you're gonna be desperate trying to chase this one client and trying to squeeze the deal out of them, even if you do, this client is not gonna send you referrals. The name of this business is referrals. Even if you squeeze the most, they're not gonna be happy. It's gonna be just one deal and then you're gonna be desperate again. It's a disaster model. You should definitely not do it. Please go part-time.